everyone. In this video, we shall create a square root spiral, which is a classroom activity for grade 9. For this, take a large sheet of paper and start with the point O. Mark the point little bit towards the left and upper side. So, if this is half of your sheet, little bit towards the left and upper side, so that we can create the whole thing on one sheet of paper. I have marked the point O here and draw a line. You can take any length. I am taking 2 cm as 1 unit. So that's here. Label it as O and P1. So here 1 unit is 2 cm. You can take any length of your choice. At point P1, draw a perpendicular using a protector. Join these two points. Now take this length which is one unit and keep the metal point here and draw an arc. This is P2. Join P2 and O. So this is one unit and this is also one unit. This is 90 degrees. So using Pythagoras theorem O P2 this length is equal to square root of 1 squared plus 1 squared which is square root of 2. So this is square root of 2. Now take OP2 as the base and draw a perpendicular at P2. Join the points. This is 90 degrees. Again take 1 unit and draw an arc from this point. This is P3. Join O and P3. Now taking O P3 as the base, draw a perpendicular at P3. Join the points. Take again unit length. Draw an arc and join these two points. This point is P4. So if you want, you can erase the extra lines. We don't need these extra lines. So you can just erase it. So this is root 2. This is root 3. This is root 4. Now taking O P4 as the baseline, draw a perpendicular. So we are drawing the perpendicular at P4. I'll take a short length because it is just one unit we need. So I'm taking this much only. Cut an arc from this point. This much. P5. Join the points. So this is also 90 degrees, this is also 90 degrees, this is also 90 degrees and this is root 5. You need to continue in this manner and every time you need to draw a perpendicular to the length that you get like here root 2, then root 3, root 4, now root 5 you take this as the base and draw a perpendicular of unit length, join the points, same way you have to continue. Then you would create a beautiful spiral. This is the same length as this length okay same length as this length we are cutting one unit 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 so it's all one unit okay So now our spiral is ready. You can see here square root of 2, square root of 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 
8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So from square root of 2 to square root of 17, you can take this 1 as square root of 1 if you want because square root of 1 is 1. So square root of 1 and this is a beautiful spiral that we have created and it is so easy to do it. I hope you find this video helpful and you can easily draw the square root spiral. Thank you.